Hey Church, I hope you're doing good. My name is Amy and I am part of our South Location team and today I want to share with you my meaningful scripture. And it's a couple of verses in Colossians 3 verse 12, it says this, Therefore, as God's chosen people, holy and dearly loved, clothe yourselves with compassion, kindness, humility, gentleness and patience. Bear with each other and forgive one another if any of you have any grievance against someone. Forgive as the Lord forgave you. And over all these virtues, put on love, which binds them all together in perfect unity. Let the peace of Christ rule in our hearts, since as members of one body, you were called to peace and be thankful. Let the message of Christ, Christ dwell among you richly as you teach and admonish one another with wisdom through the Psalms, hymns and songs from the Spirit, singing to God with gratitude in your hearts. And whatever you do, whether in word or deed, do it all in the name of the Lord Jesus, giving thanks to God the Father through him. I don't know how your day looks today. I don't know how your week looks. I don't know what situation you're in right now, but um, why not take this scripture today and declare it over your life right now? And um, I love every single one of these verses, but I think... The first bit, it says, clothe yourself with compassion, kindness, humility, gentleness, and patience, and forgive one another. And then it goes on to say, and over all of these virtues, put on love, which binds them all together in perfect unity. I, I don't know about you, but the world we're living in at the moment, we need unity. And we can do that through love today. So wherever you are today, whether you're going to work or school or whatever it is, why don't you just choose today to put those things on Clothe yourselves in the fruits of the Spirit. Clothe yourself in, in compassion and kindness and humility and gentleness and patience and love and forgiveness and show people today what Jesus is about. It then goes on to say, um, at the end of the verse uh, 17, it says, whatever you do, whether in word or deed, do it all in the name of the Lord Jesus, giving thanks to God the Father through him. So why not today, whatever you're doing, whether it's the littlest things or the biggest things you've got going on this week or today, just do it in the name of God. Take it to God, say, God, I'm giving you this today and you will excel, you will be blessed, you will, be, um, you will see things around you start to shift because of the way you choose to live today. So yeah, can I encourage you, read that verse today. Um, and yeah, I'll just quickly pray for your day and then you can go for it. So God, we just thank you for each and every person that's watching this today. I thank you for your your word, God. And I thank you that um, today we, we get the opportunity to read your word and um, just experience your love. And I just pray right now that we will go out into our days um, just full of your love, God, full of your kindness and your richness and your goodness. And whatever we're going through or whatever is going on today, I pray, Holy Spirit, will you dwell in our hearts right now? Will you bring peace among us, God, and bring unity um, in our families, in our friendships, in our uh, cities, in our schools, in our work, God? I just pray right now as we choose to live like you, God, that you um, will do something miraculous in our lives, Lord. And we will see the blessing of just everything that you are. In Jesus' name, amen. Have a great day. Bye.